These are some of the things you'll need. First, you're going to take off all your nail polish that you had on before, if you had any on. And then, apply a base coat to all your nails. let that dry. Next, after your nail polish or your base coat has dried, you're going to take three colors and do an ombre effect directly on your nails. So I'm using purple, pink, and yellow. And then you're going to take like a toothpick and mix it through. So I'm just going to be using this red thingy I found. And I'm going to be kind of mixing them together. So it gives it an airy ombre effect. Because the spongy does not work for me. Like that. And that's what it looks like. And you're going to do that on all your nails. After you have done this to all your nails and it has dried, you're going to take a black striper and make lines on your nails, which I'm going to show you how. You're going to start from the top corner, I think, yep, and bring it down to right about there, like that. And then you're going to make another line going from the bottom up to that line. And then you're going to make a bunch of little lines going like this, up, like that. It doesn't really matter how many, but. And then you're going to make about three to four lines, mostly, most likely three, just following that line. or two. So that's what it looks like right now and I'm going to touch it up a second here. And then you're going to make lines diagonal this way like this. And there you have it. And do that to all your nails. And I will show you when I'm done. Now that this has dried almost fully, um, there, if you messed up around the edges, I'm just going to take this Q-tip thing and dip it in um, 
paint remover, nail polish remover, and clean up around the edges. Like so. Now it is all cleaned up pretty much. Oh, not really. Okay, now that it's cleaned up, you're going to apply a top coat and you're done. Thanks for watching. See you next time.